Hi my friends, today we model this uh, sheet metal part which has uh, a name, hanging support. It has, uh, as usual, bends and uh, cuts and some uh, rounded corner or fillets like this. The drawing is this one. This is the unfolded uh, model with the uh, general dimensions. The thickness is two millimeters. Non-dimensioned fillets are two millimeters radius. Where are this? Look here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight fillets or uh, rounded corner. Let's start. Sheet metal millimeters. Sketch XY and we have to take a look to the dimension. One hundred and two millimeters. I want to create this face. Yes. One oh two thirty six one hundred and twelve. and 83 this line from the center point 83 then uh, 112 10 Two thirty six. We go back to the X axis and close escape fully constrained. Finish sketch. Now we want to create a volume and the thickness is two millimeters. We have to set this sheet metal defaults not from the rule but from our wheel. Okay face okay now we create a flange this flange on this edge with uh, the dimension of 56 plus 4 you see here we start from this end four millimeters plus 56. Flange this edge, 56 plus four. We don't calculate by heart ever. Then a new face, a new extension, this one, this one, outside the flange, with dimensions 120 and 56 is uh, what resulted. Face, sketch, 
rectangle we place uh, we, we apply coincident between this line and this point and dimension of 120 120 because this is 56 you see finish sketch face I have to select which one because there is a rectangle here this is the new face and we have a new extension here is a cut of 6 and with 50 from the other end yes we apply this cut rectangle from this corner tab 6 the other dimension is 50 50 finish sketch cut and this must be cutted okay next is uh, this flange which has a dimension of uh, 20 plus 4 because we measure from here you see a small line yes it is finished on this alignment yes good good to know flange and this edge and dimension of 20 plus 4 okay there is a cut here with uh, 11 at the other end now we have this end so I select this I create a new sketch I start from the very corner to somewhere not in the middle of course to place a dimension of 11 a new cut is this sloped one okay now this small uh, flange with a dimension of 22 flange and this edge 22 okay there is a cut here now yes the other flange is this one which has uh, also 22 but measured from the inside yes from the inside of course 22 all the way up to down flange this edge and 22 again okay 
we have all the flanges placed in position. We continue with holes and cuts. I start with this circle because we have a, a rectangular pattern of two or three, two or three six uh, holes. Dimension for the first one is eight by eight. I create a point. I dimension that point eight on eight. Finish sketch. Hole diameter of eight. Okay then rectangular pattern of this feature on direction two directions one is 30 the other is 40 but the step is 40 divided by 2 this direction is 30 with two instances yes two and the other direction is this one reverted three not two at a step of 40 divided by two okay other holes are uh, that three eight Here, 59, twenty-eight. This is also eight. If we calculate, we find eight here. But this is seventy-five minus fifty-nine divided by two. It seems to be symmetrical, but we have to place this dimension here. Yes. Good. We do this by selecting this face for a sketch. We draw lines, my friend. One twenty-eight is the other. dimension for this is 59 as I said and dimension from the bottom to the first point is not 8 it is 75 minus 59 minus this divided by 2 yes ok the result is 8 the other dimension is the horizontal distance of 8 now we place points at the end of each line and hold automatically diameter of 8 ok other holes are here you see 12 millimeters with 64 distance of 19 diameter of 10 two holes face sketch line with a length of 64 
placed at a distance from the end to this line of 12. and the other dimension of 19. Nineteen points at the ends. It is not necessary to make this construction because pole is applied automatically and we don't have any problem. Not eight, but ten. Okay. The last is uh, this slot, fourteen at uh, 25 from the hole, radius 3. You know we use diameter here. Okay, aligned on vertical on 19. Slot in a sketch. Slot center to center. 14 is the dimension and this is the diameter 3 multiplied by 2 because the dimension is radius we in include this line small line um, this point included in the line and dimension of uh, 25 from the hole to the bottom center yes it is 25 okay finish sketch cut This is to be eliminated. Okay. And now we place the material. Material is uh, steel carbon. And we verify the volume. High properties. Physical. Update. Copy, close, IDW, double click on the volume, and there is a small difference, no problem. This is the volume. But let me change it. Yes, yes, because this is our work. This is the result. Okay. What I done today is uh, coming to this result. That's all for today. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.